Hey there, this is Kat, and this is your Marketing Minute. Today, I want to talk to you about the word persistent. Now, persistent is usually and typically associated with sales or um, maybe a startup or maybe the activity that you're doing to generate something, right? So persistent. I want to use persistent in regards to an association with your branding and what you're doing with your social media to continuously remind your future customers who you are, what, what you do and how to get a hold of you. So persistence, just like when you're cold calling or when you're doing business development, you have to be very persistent, meaning you're knocking on their door, you're calling them a couple times, you're asking them over and over, are you interested, are you interested, until you're blue in the face, right? You're being very persistent because you don't know what that person, you know, if they're having a bad day or if it's a bad timing or whatever the case. So you have to be persistent. You have to be to remind them, hey, you showed some interest and I'm just reminding you, I'm knocking on the door and I'm trying to remind you that we're here for you and we would like to offer a proposal or a quote or something, whatever the case may be. Persistent applies to your social media and your personal presence as well, because if you're not doing something constantly to remind your future customers who you are, what you do and how to get a hold of you, you're not being persistent in reminding them to think about you or put you on their shopping list when that time comes that they need your good services, um, you know, product, whatever the case may be. So you have to be persistent and you have to be persistent on social media, meaning you have to remind that future customer over and over and over all the time all the time forever till the till your business closes so persistent you have to have some type of strategy in place and i always call this the layer effect okay because you want to find something that's not going to kill you or break your your business that is affordable enough that you can keep doing it forever okay and social media is one of the ones that it's easy and everybody's on social media so what a great fit to be persistent on social media but are you truly being persistent are you just posting like one post or two posts a week and then scatter and then you skip a week or two and then you post again that's not persistent persistent means every single day over and over and over you have a strategy in place in order for your brand or business or product or good or service to be persistent to be able to remind that future customers who you are what you do and how to get a hold of you if you do not have this in place and you make the assumption they will find me good luck because you're basically what you're doing is you're creating the writing on the wall that your business will close down because you're not asking people to remember you. So persistent, be persistent with your social media. Use that as an opportunity to continuously remind your future customers who you are, what you do and how to get a hold of you forever. It doesn't stop forever. The day that you stop reminding your future customers is the day that you're saying you're ready to close the doors and you're ready to go out of business. Hey, I'm Kat Ramirez, CEO and founder of Advertise, hashtag social buzz and 10X business broker. Follow me and learn more ways to help you stand out and grow. You got this. <laughs>